All right, this is Jason with the Primal Outdoors channel, and today we're gonna head up into the Cascade Mountains, and I'm really hoping to get to a little lake called Link Lake, but there's been a lot of snow in the mountains over the past month, so I don't know what the accessibility will be getting into there. But it's been absolutely gorgeous in Central Oregon in this last week, being up in the 70s, so I might find myself getting up there and there's no snow at all. We'll just have to check it out and see. All right, so we had no problem getting to the lake. There's absolutely no snow up here. I mean, you can tell that there probably was a little bit of snow up here maybe a couple weeks ago or a week ago, but as it is right now, there's no snow whatsoever. And it is absolutely just a gorgeous day. It's probably in the 70s right now, but the lake looks awesome. There's one problem I was really hoping that I would be able to see Mount Washington from the lake, but the lake kind of sits in a depression a little bit and you can't really see anything beyond it. But that's okay, because the lake itself is absolutely gorgeous. And uh, I'm sure that with all the color and everything that's going on around here right now, um, with all the leaves and everything on the shoreline and just being a beautiful location that I'll have no problem finding a really cool composition that we can shoot. Uh, probably, you know, I'll kind of look and see how things go this evening, but I'm probably going to target tomorrow morning uh, sunrise for the shoot because then the sun will be coming up behind me and coming up and over and lighting the lake and all the background. So that probably will be my, my plan. But as it is right now, I'm going to get my camp set up and uh, start kind of settling in for the day. All right, so now that I got camp all set up and everything, it's starting to get a little bit later in the afternoon and uh, the sun is starting to kind of set here across the water and it's looking really, really nice. So I'm thinking I'm gonna go ahead and probably set up and try to find a composition and go ahead and shoot some sort of, you know, sunset photo across the lake because it's just looking too awesome. There's a little bit of mist on the other side, which looks really cool. And um, yeah, I just think it's gonna be a really, really nice evening, really epic sunset. So I'm gonna get the camera and tripod set up and, and uh, see what we can come up with. All right, so I've got myself set up here. I finally found a composition that I really like. 
Um, I kind of played around with some other ones and I even set the camera up, but I, in the end, I, I just wasn't really digging it. So I ended up coming back and kind of just sitting here under the awning and um, I was just looking out over the lake and I thought, and I started looking through these trees right here and I thought, wow, that's, that's really beautiful right there. That maybe that's what I, so I brought the camera over, checked the composition, decided yes, I did like it very much. So I've set it up here. And so I put my uh, three stop, my Lee three stop grad, soft grad filter on uh, just to kind of bring down the exposure from the sun uh, still being up in the sky. Uh, but still allowing me to, you know, kind of expose for this brush and the trees around here looking through here But the trees just kind of nicely frame this shot and then you just got the lake right out behind there And there's just some a little bit of mist just uh, kind of floating on top of the water But it's just super gorgeous super gorgeous. So I'm gonna take the shot. Um, I'm 1 20th of a second f11 uh, ISO 64 and I got my two second timer set. So we'll just uh, So we're up this morning and uh, we're set up in a composition that I was going to do yesterday, but I decided that uh, not to do it because, well, one, I found the other composition that I liked better, but the reason why I didn't really like this one yesterday was because the sun was backlighting everything so, so harshly that I felt like I was really not getting the definition and the, sh and the uh, reflections on the water of the trees. Uh, as well as I definitely am this morning. This morning they're very defined. Uh, it looks just like a mirror out here. So anyhow, we've got, uh, the sun is just now starting to kind of come up over the hill and it's just now starting to kind of light the trees uh, above the water and it just looks absolutely amazing uh, this morning. So I've got my three stop uh, soft graduated filter on just to kind of lower the exposure on the trees a little bit so that I can bring up the exposure on the water and really pick up this reflection. But the water is just glass, smooth glass this morning. So it's just like a mirror, absolutely great. <laughs>
right, so we've just been kind of kicking back here and enjoying the morning, and uh, it's just been really nice. Uh, just absolutely beautiful, calm morning. Uh, I've taken some opportunity here to kind of sit down and catch up with a few of you guys' comments. And man, uh, this location has just been really nice. And the nice thing about it is it's not too far out of town. It's very accessible, uh, great place to camp, beautiful, just a beautiful little spot. But like everything, or all good things, it must eventually come to an end. And I do need to think about uh, packing up and, and heading home and getting back to the daily grind of, of things. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, please give me a like. And of course, I really enjoy the comments. And if you're not subscribed already, please do. Uh, I really, uh, I'm always trying to get videos like this out every week. So uh, if you're not a subscriber and you enjoyed this video, please become a subscriber and uh, hit the little uh, notification bell so you get uh, notified when I do do videos. And I'll catch you guys again outside. <music>